Crypto Dog to the rescue here. So YouTube has changed their algorithm again, and uh, it helped me out if you smash the like button, hit the bell, and comment below. Let's get right into it. All right, also I want to remind everybody that I'm still doing a subscription giveaway. Once I hit 100 subscribers, I'm going to do a random giveaway to one of my subscribers for either one of these Bitcoin or Ethereum's or, and a gold uh, silver certificate that I have showing here, right here. So, uh, guys interested, you know, uh, please subscribe. All right, so let's get right into it here. Uh, Bitcoin's at 91.36. It is uh, Sunday on a weekend. And as you know, market never, never stops. So... On cryptocurrency so and 234 for ethereum so um keep that in mind you know that'll come back into play here right here in a second so let's go into a chart um as i was saying from my last video uh i don't know where it's really going right now i mean everything's on a precipice and if you look at my last video i actually traced the uh, fibonacci back from here to here the last high point to the last low point well because i'm putting on day candles you know i can actually come back here and see from you know a longer investment point of view um, how um, how things are kind of looking if it gave any gave me any more probabilities or anything like that let me get my big fat head out of the way and we'll go from there uh, let me make sure my big fat head got out of the way and yeah there we go all right so as you can see on here I traced it all the way back to after the last the last high basically um, and then we we dipped down in March and then now it's kind of riding right on the halfway mark there. So, again, I don't know what's going to happen. And it seems like historically when things like this happen, as we've already gradually gone up, just like this, we've already gradually gone up. We went up already. It kind of seems like that's the play that's going to be happen just based on, I guess, cyclical data you know what i mean i don't know how it's still so it's all 50 50 so i don't know how reliable a lot of this stuff is so um when it comes to this volatile of a market it's very volatile as you know cryptocurrency so um i'm just waiting for something big to happen whether it goes up or down if i miss it you know okay you know that, that's that's fine yeah i don't know i didn't know you know that's fine so live with what your decisions uh, ultimately. Uh, Robert T. Kiyosaki, you know, this is something that I wanted to let everybody know and at least uh, say, hey, I would recommend reading some Robert T. Kiyosaki books just based on uh, mentality. You know, being an entrepreneur, which is something I think a lot of people should be thinking like as an entrepreneur um, and not a worker. Um, or at least saying, hey, I need a job, I need a job, and as opposed to saying, how do I get money? You know, how can I, uh, that hunger of getting money, how can that make me think to get more money? So it's uh, kind of a good place to start uh, if you're thinking about uh, investing in cryptocurrency, stock market, precious metals, whatever you're into. And that's something that, and that's what I'm into right now, obviously, is cryptocurrency for the past two, three years, precious metals for I don't know how long, and um, uh, looking into other avenues of cash flow and money. So cryptocurrency, like I said, Brave uh, is something I wanted to touch on. You know, I just use Brave like I use any other browser, you know, Google Chrome or anything. And I'm up to four bat, which is basic attention token. And, uh, you know, I think they're only worth like 26 bucks. They're 26 cents right now. But, you know, it, it's free. You know, I don't do anything for it. And I look at ads sometimes. If not, I still somehow get free coins. So it works for me. Um, touch on my dog sanctuary and cryptocurrency mining to sustain project that I'm doing uh, from startsomegood.com. I have not posted it yet. I still need to do a YouTube video or not a YouTube video, but an actual video, not a YouTube for this start some good. But man, you know, it's again, it's tough to make a video. I'm going to have to hire somebody uh, to help me out, get the editing done and the music in and the fading in, the fading out, and, you know, cutting in and all this other stuff. Um, but that's my goal was that sustaining, you know, cryptocurrency mining, sustaining a dog sanctuary. And this is what I'm looking into to want to live in. This is my dream here. Goal is to live in one of these tiny homes. And my buddy posted this on Facebook. So, you know, rough cut, tiny homes. Uh, awesome. I mean, these things are freaking awesome. And I would live in these absolutely dog friendly as it's all wood. 
you know, um, and it's beautiful looking and it's up to date and it's just tiny, you know, I'm not a huge guy. I'm not seven foot, I'm not six foot. So, well, close to it, but not six foot. So, uh, that's my goal. Just want to touch on that. So moving forward, precious metals, right? I've been going over precious metals the last couple of videos because I wanted, you know, letting everybody know that's what I'm getting into as well. And I think I was talking about JM Bouillon past couple videos and SD Bouillon I've actually run across and they're, they're actually cheaper than anyone else right now. 2143, actually 2189 if you do check by wire, which is basically you're connecting your checking account um, an e-check. So you get that discount with an e-check or you can use Bitcoin. You know, you can buy it with Bitcoin as well. And right now they actually have these in stock, a lot of uh, these rounds, not many though. But they do have them in stock, so that's a good thing to see. Uh, let's see if we can get my uh, doo 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 doo. All right, so yeah, as you can see, it's twenty one eighty nine, and then with Bitcoin, it's twenty two eleven. So, and that again is based on the silver price of nineteen forty four. Well, again, there's kind of something you got to think about is you know the price hasn't changed over the weekend, which is why I kind of mentioned it was Sunday, and. I had to kind of look into this. Why isn't it changing? Well, it, it just, you know, the price of it changes with the stock market. Um, so it's on supply and demand. So it, it kind of makes sense. So I'll get into that a little bit as opposed to, you know, the silver price right now and where to go look at it. Uh, another thing that I'm doing, you know, just for this channel, I wanted to give everybody a heads up. Um, so I bought a couple of these things or one of these things each. An estate lot sale of old rare U.S. currency, an estate lot sale, 50 plus pieces, blah, blah, blah. I'm going to do videos on these here and, uh, when I pick, when I get them, obviously in the mail, and uh, I'm going to go over them and see if they're actually worth it for you guys. So I've seen videos on these where they're really, really good, and I've seen video on these when they're really, really bad. So I will let you guys know on that. Uh, moving forward, you know, when you guys are doing, looking into getting coins and silver and gold and all that, it's always good to go look for a local dealer. So I just found one, uh, you know, again, I just moved here to Las Vegas for my job because um, I still need that job. Um, and uh, really the job helps me, you know, learn the corporate world. Um, so it's all men mentality game and perspective. Um, Archangel Coins, you know, they, they're they really great. And, uh, you know, I'm starting to gain a rapport with them. So pricing and all that stuff, you know, we can negotiate a little bit being as I'm going to be an ongoing customer. So something you want to think about. Another thing you want to think about is taxes. You know, I live in Nevada now, so I have, luckily, Nevada has no income tax on uh, capital gains uh, from precious metals. So great for me, you know, I get, when I uh, get a profit, when the price of silver and gold goes up and platinum and, you know, rhodium or whatever you're into, then once that all goes up, you, you don't have to pay capital gains on it. So that, that's great. I mean, that's awesome to see. Um, I think Arizona does it as well. Utah does it as well. So good thing. So moving into the price of silver, uh, as you can see, it says here 1932. Now, Kitco.com is actually what most um, dealers go off of. So when you go to a coin dealership or anything like that, they will probably pull up Kitco and give you the spot price on that print and then, you know, premium, whatever off that spot price. So That'll tell you at least something through the weekend that it's at 1932 right now, and gold is at 1810. I'm sorry, 1797. Low and high, bid and ask. So ask 1811, I guess is what you want to say. Um, so keep that in mind when you are looking for gold or and silver. You know what I mean? And so that way you can kind of figure it out. Well, they're going off the 1944 um, spot price, and then they're putting a premium on there of what two. 250, you know, that's not bad, you know, so SD Bouillon is actually really, really good with their pricing and premiums over spot price. So, uh, you know, keep it in mind, you know, my name is Crypto Dog to the rescue. Again, please smash the like button, hit the bell, comment below, helps me and uh, YouTube's changed their algorithm, so it'll help me out greatly and keep me uh, on and going. You guys, keep up the grind.